them scrambling up the companionway to the deck. And so they went, down to the sea in ships. The sequence you're about to see from a film of that name shot in 1921 shows the whale ship Morgan on her last voyage before coming to Mystic Seaport. Alongside, the body is made fast to deck bits by chains. The work of cutting in the blubber begins. At the windlass, the crew hoists the heavy blubber aboard as it is cut free from the carcass. On the stage, the men chop away with their long spades. In the head of the sperm whale is a great reservoir containing pure spermaceti oil, the finest natural oil ever found. The head with its case is hoisted aboard. The great teeth a terror to all whalemen, became the chief material for the art of scrimshawing. The limpid oil in the case is carefully saved. The blubber is cut into sections and tossed into the kettles built in the brick triworks on deck. The great blaze from the fires increases as the night wears on. We will never wholly die, even in our times a few are left. But in the days when the clipper was the queen of the sea, 